All right, so guess what? This Prius E-Pass system showed up on my doorstep. The price was right. I figured I'd jump on it, even though it might be a little while before we put this thing in the car. If you recall, uh, I converted the car to manual steering and it was always in the plan to go to an E-Pass system. I think the shoulder surgery just kind of accelerated that process. So again, this thing showed up today. I figured we might as well bench test it, make sure it works before we put it away for a little bit while we're done screwing around with the electric turbo. And joining me to help in this display is my loving child. You may remember her from such hits as, Dad, you idiot. It's gonna, oh, it's overflowing. I did say loving child. Dad, you idiot. Yes, she did survive that incident, and now she's joining us again to assist in the e-pass testing. You should see the face she's making right now. So the way, what we have here is a basic setup. This, this thing only requires three connections to work. There's a ground, which is this wire. There's a positive power and an ignition uh, power, which is obviously in this case, just tied to the positive power for our test. Here's a 12 volt, 10 amp supply. We're not applying anywhere near the forces that you see in the car for the bench test. So I'm okay with using these thin alligator clips and you know, we're not gonna melt anything down. So let's go ahead and connect these things up. And you may hear a click. Okay, and it takes about 10 seconds or so, I haven't actually timed it yet, to enter its safety mode. So let's go ahead and turn on our ammeter here. Make sure we put it to 40 amps. And you know what? Let's go ahead and disconnect and zero ourselves out here. It's the thing about clamp on ammeters. All right powered again. All right, so we're hovering around 300 milliamps. Go ahead, Sparky, grab the vice grip and the motor with the other hand, because we know that this thing's going to torque over as we played with it already. I'm going to use one finger, okay? You try to resist my one finger. Resist the finger. Resist the finger. Resist the finger. Can you do it? No. All right, let's uh, we'll stop doing that. <laughs> Center it up. All right, actually go this way just a little bit because we're going to try going that way now. And you can see the ammeter reads a lot more current when we do this. So she's trying to resist and we're over three, four amps right there. Let's go back the other way. Not a chance, right? So let's go ahead and disconnect this. Let's see if I can do the same thing. Ow. <laughs> Ow. All right, let's go this way. Ow. Okay, so clearly she works. All right, Sparky, I'll give you 10 bucks if you can resist the finger. Ready? Ouch. <laughs> Hold on. Really, you think so? Wait, 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 wait. Really? Wow. Oh, wait, I wasn't ready. That was actually pretty impressive. You were actually I doing it. I, <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't sure it was working. That doesn't count. It does not count. I don't owe her $10. No, nine, nine. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Stefan Gottswinter, okay, you got that joke. All right, here we go. Ready? Yeah, there, <laughs> there's no chance. So there you go. The system works. It's it actually this is from I believe a 2005 Prius exactly, uh, and uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun at parties too. You know, you can do the whole you know I must break you arm wrestling thing, and there you go. You be the I don't know the. Dude at parties, I guess. Nine, subscribe.